Hey tubers, uh, a tuber named Tyson sent me a message saying that his 2003 Tundra has the same check engine code that mine had, small leak evap system, and he's been trying the gas cap, gas tank filler, all that stuff isn't working for him. You know, he's replaced it and it's not doing it what he needs. Now when mine went, okay, this is part of the evap system here. All these friggin' hoses, I don't exactly know how they work, but that was the hose that gave me the trouble. See the little green thing, you just trace it up. Basically what I did was I just started pulling on all these friggin' hoses to make sure all the clamps were tight. And when I yanked on this hose, it just popped off. So what you're doing is you wanna look, Tyson, at all the friggin' little clamps here. And you know, yank on the hoses and make sure all your, your hose clamps are nice and tight. Because if any of these hoses have a weak clamp or you can just twist them and they wiggle in your hand, get yourself a nice little friggin' hose clamp, do it dirty and you'll be happy. Okay, I hope this helps you. I'm gonna post it in about two minutes. Man, how'd that shit get in there? White paint? What the hell's white paint coming from? Man, I have no idea. Well, anyways, so Tyson, I hope this helps. Like I said, that was the hose that was loose on mine, but all of these hoses here are part of the EVAB system, and if you get one of those uh, Haynes manuals, they show you the hose routing, but like I said, just find this little green thing and then just start pulling all these different hoses to see which one, if any, have a loose clamp. And when you do that, if you're lucky, like I was, you'll find a hose that was loose, you'll put a clamp on it, and uh, the check engine light goes away or you can just reset it and it's gone.